without the mental state that today I'm no longer be a f***ing loser. No one can explain why you are alive. No one can save you but you. You have to put the mind into what you want to put the mind into. If you believe in something, you can achieve it. People may hear all this and say, God, this guy is such a structured guy, talking about demons, getting over things. That's not like his whole life. It's true, but I'm the most peaceful person on the planet Earth. Even with like the conversation, like I go to the gym, I have to do this, I have to do that. Every day I'm winning the, uh, the other voice in my head. So I, I'm, I'm at peace with myself. People who many times when something happens to them, that they embrace it from a place of fear and it takes them out. The thing that people do, they avoid discomfort. It sounds ridiculous, but it just creates more discomfort. You don't realize that in embracing discomfort and forcing yourself to do something very uncomfortable that you can control, you are eliminating another form of discomfort. Shut that down. Do not listen to that little voice. Don't, don't give in to the immediate gratification that is whispering in your ear. Elsie Robinson said, things may happen to you and things may happen around you, but the most important things are the things that happen in you. And you have to stand up inside yourself and deal with it and handle it. The things I do for fun are like me bettering myself. I love sports, I love watching sports, but I also love accomplishing and overcoming myself every day. Because every day is a battle. Every day is a battle because your mind wants to choose the path of least resistance. Every day. But you don't become better by, by ever doing that become normal and I don't want to be normal. Go through the motions. Lift the weights. Sprint the hill. Work on the project. Get out of bed. Now, as an overall rule, I do not like procrastination. You need to get things done. Today I'm going to change my path. I'm going to get on the path of success. I don't care how long that road is. I'm going to see it through no matter what. Because you know what? I've been living enough years in this shithole and I don't want to be here anymore.